Hey guys! So we are here and we are going to do a random favorites. Woo! Because for July, that's scary. Where is the year gone? Well, let's just get into it. All right. What's the first thing? Uh, first thing is your favorite snack. Okay, I gotta get mine so you go first. Okay. Well, I eat lots of food, and so I just love all things that are food-esque, I guess. <laughs> and, but my favorite thing to munch on is milk chocolate covered almonds. And these are from Bar Barracini? 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 Whatever. You know. They're delici- oh, can't say. They're delicioso. <laughs> My favorite snack is the Nature Valley Oats and Honey. These are my favorite snacks. I'm never without one in my bag. They're delicious. They're very kind of obnoxious to eat because mm. you just crunch and crunch and crunch. But they're so good. And they're only like... I like I like the um, dark chocolate ones better. They're only 190 calories, and this is perfect for me when I'm at work and need a little pick me up. I have one of these. So that's great. Okay, number two, jewelry item. So I chose two. As you would. And the first one is my rings. I like wearing a shit ton of rings all the time because I don't know. I just like the look of having like rings everywhere. So many rings. And then I also chose my watch, and this is from Urban Outfitters. And it's by La Mer, or La Mer, however you want to, like, pronounce it. But it's, like, a wraparound one. So it kind of looks like a... Sorry, I'm blocking. Oh, go ahead. It kind of looks like a bracelet and a watch. And it's brown leather and black leather, Yeah. Right? And I like... dark I, brown and... No, it's, like, black and brown with, like, these little gold studs on it. And I like the clash of black around. And I don't know. I don't really wear watches a lot. And I don't really wear bracelets a lot. So I thought when I wear a watch, like killing two birds with one stone, because it looks like you're wearing a bracelet, you know? And my favorite jewelry item this month has been my earrings. Your arms. I don't know if you can. They're octagons, perhaps? <laughs> I'm not quite sure. Let me see how many sizes they And have. gold. Maybe they're oh, a hexagon? A six, so a hexagon. God, I have no idea. Whatever. Anyway, and geometry was not my thing. And they're, um, they've got like a little blue stone in the center. They're by Marc Jacobs and I got them for Christmas and they just go with everything. And I'm a person, if you can't tell by my outfit today, who doesn't wear any color. Like no color at all. My wardrobe consists of black and gray. And so I like to add a pop of color where I can. Okay, number three, favorite item of clothing. All right. Okay, so this article of clothing, I've been looking for for like ever and ever and ever. And I checked on every single website possible. Like for everyone, whoever had owned these items, I was always like, where did you get those? And they're like, <laughs> Forever 21. I'm like, that's a lie. Because I've been looking on Forever 21's website for like five years and they don't have it. And then I went on Urban Outfitters and Urban Outfitters was like $60. And then I went on Etsy. Have you been on Etsy before? I love Etsy. Yeah, I went on there, and but none of them just had like plain classic of what I wanted. They just had like ripped, studded, dip dyed up your hoo ha jeans <laughs> that looked like underwear. So finally, I was like, I went on American Apparel, and even though these are almost as expensive as the ones on Urban Outfitters, I don't know. I like, I like these. They American Apparel. Yeah, I like these better. And there are high waisted jean shorts, and these are like a light wash one. And they're just like classic. They don't have like anything about them. They just look like a pair of mom jeans. <laughs> and I don't know. I just like them because they're cute and they look good. They look very and they make cute. you look really skinny because you know it's like right there. So it's and like, then make your butt totally like yeah and I already have a big butt as it is so I mean it's just like hello oh my article of clothing my hair band I kind of did an accessory oh okay. but I, you I wear it all the time so I guess technically that works it's fine oh well this counts it's like an article of clothing yeah okay so this is my leather bag from J Crew. Oh, this bag it's so cute it's got little I don't know if I can show this little studs on the bottom and, oh and on the strap, let me get out my rice cakes and my next favorite and all the stuff. As you can see, I bring it to work with me every day. This is the inside. It's got like a cell phone pocket and then just like a bigger open pocket. And then on the other side, it's got 
a full zipper pocket. It's really, and it's really big and it's not too structured so it can fit a ton of stuff. Like um, classic, you know. Very classic and I thought it was so work appropriate. You like can't so, go wrong with it. And I'll never like go out. Good wife like, style, yeah. Leather never goes out. So it's like perfect. So yeah, this has been my favorite. I've been using it every day. Woohoo! Alright, next is favorite perfume. And mine is I didn't even get mine out. Hang on. Okay, well while she's getting hers, I'm gonna talk about mine. And mine is Gucci Get Ooh. For the reflection. Mine is Gucci. <laughs> Hello! Mine is Gucci. Like for the fourth time. Gucci <laughs> guilty. It's what it is. And it smells so good. I love the smell of this stuff. And this is like my how, first. Well, how would you describe it? I like can't even be Sexy or sweet. Definitely or sexy. Formal. Definitely like a, a nighttime kind of scenario. It smells like their other one, the one that you have. I know, that's actually my favorite. So yeah. I'll show that next. Well, the ones that she's about to show kind of smells like it. It's very, I don't know, it's very sultry and like, ooh, you know? But not overpowering. It's kind of Yeah, insane. it's very nice. I wear, I wear it during the day. But the one thing that I don't like about it is the packaging. However, it is very cute and like, you know, like mirror-esque. But you can see all my fingerprints on it. Much as easily. Yeah, and it just like kind of ruins it for me. But it's really cute and I like it. It's like my first big girl perfume that I've ever owned. So it's like exciting. <laughs> Learn out my favorite has been the Gucci by Gucci, and this is the it comes in a dark version, like a dark bottle and a light bottle. I guess the scents must differ slightly, but so I like the light one. You had that one for like you buy. I've one had this perfume, like worn this perfume since I was like since probably like freshman year of high school, and um, so I've had many bottles of this. Like I always ask for it for Christmas because it's rather expensive but I love it. It smells so it smells good. so light. It is quite floral but um I love it. It's not overpowering. It's just like you wear yeah, it. Yeah mine's like just, less floral than this one. You smell they're just like girly. Yeah That's it's why really cute. It's girly and I love the packaging. I think it's so sleek yeah. with the two like frosted glass lines and then the little the horse bit. I yeah. love the horse bit. Number five, favorite hairstyle. In case you couldn't tell from the past <laughs> video and this video, my favorite hairstyle to wear is a top knot. And can you see it? Yeah. Can I show you? Kind of, yeah. And, uh, <laughs> and the reason why I like wearing this is because it's just so easy. And my hair is really long. Like, you can't Super tell long. because it's up, but it goes down to, like, my belly button. I'm well, like, past my belly button now. But, like, <laughs> it's, like, really long. And so it gets really greasy, like, easily. And, like... When I don't wash it, it becomes like, because it's so long, it gets tangled so easily and it's just like gross after like the second, well like I wash my hair and then I don't wash my hair and that day where I don't wash my hair, it gets gross. So I, <laughs> so I like, technical. I either have to curl it or I have to put it in this top knot and I love wearing it. And I'm a dancer too, so just like ballet buns come like natural to me. <laughs> and I don't know, I like it. And I think it just looks so cute, especially when they're like messy and you wear it with like a little headband like this. I don't know, I like it. Uh, well, as you can see by my hair, I've been loving doing half up, half down numbers. And especially- to the back, um, as you do it cutely. You know, she doesn't just like bobby pin it, she like does a little fun you... fun. So anyway, yeah, I've been loving wearing my hair half up, half down. I've been working, so it's like still, it's work appropriate. It kind of makes it a little more sophisticated. And it's great for second day hair. When I just don't know what to do with it, I shove tons of dry shampoo in my hair yeah. to give it like a little bit of grip here. And then I literally, I just chuck it all back, and whether it's in like bobby pins like this or just like a claw clip. But still, then you get the pull back off your face so it's like sophisticated and it's still kind of clean looking. So yeah, it's cute. Best of both worlds. I love it. I just want to mention that I am taller than her. Okay. <laughs> she doesn't look it in this video. But Thank I God. am. Number six, favorite TV show. Mine is a throwback. One of them's a throwback, and it's Friday Night Lights, and it's so I would like to say that I'm the one that told her to watch it. Yeah, it's so good. It's oh my gosh. Phenomenal. If you guys haven't seen it, you need to go watch it now. It's on Netflix Instant if you're a member with Netflix and you need to go watch it. And there's another show and it's so embarrassing and it's also on Netflix Instant and it's <laughs> Dance Academy. It's so good. Okay, like stupid. it's so stupid. stupid. It's so stupid, but I was addicted to it. I just, there was only two seasons and I just watched like the whole, like both two seasons. I finished it today and let me tell you, it ended so dramatically like wowzers it was 
I cried. I'm not gonna lie. I sat and I cried. That's pathetic. Deal. Are you done? Yes. Okay. <laughs> My favorite is the holy grail of WB, if you're old enough to know what the WB if is. If you're not, then you just need to stop watching. You just need to stop it. It was the hit series of the WB in the 90s. <gasps> Dun -dun -dun -dun. Dawson's Creek. Dawson's Creek. There, okay, well, it's the best show. I mean, some people are like, oh my god, it's so whiny and all we do is talk about sex. It's, it's true. It's true, but it's phenomenal. And it's so invested in the characters, and like, it's one of the only shows that actually gets better when they go to college. Tell them about our summers. Um, oh, and every summer, Rosie and my, our mom, we all watch it together. We watch all six seasons. Every summer. Every summer. Currently on season number five right Woo! now. So good. And I've turned like all of my friends onto it, and they're all like, oh no, like I watched it on enough when it was on TV. And, I was like, no, you gotta watch it from the beginning. Yeah. Watch the entire so thing. Good. You'll love it and all of them. Okay, number seven, favorite song. All right, mine is an, a throwback as well. And did I just run out of battery? What's happening? There we go. Okay, and I don't know if any of you remember Panic at the Disco, but I've recently just become obsessed with them again. Literally, I played the song 25 times and probably more though because I like listened to it on YouTube before it. And it's called Sarah Smiles. It's so good, you guys. It's, it just makes me just want to like jiggle, you know? Pop. Yeah. Mine's not. Mine's like a favorite of right now. I have such an eclectic taste in music. She does. I mean, I recently got way more into country. I yeah, decided I want to move to the south. Did I you know. just change your song? I just changed she my just song. She just changed it. But she I was thinking about it and I was like, you know what? This is truly my favorite right now. All right. Sorry. I'm trying to find out my iTunes. Okay. Oh my god. I love this one too. So good. Just listen to it. This is Why Don't We Just Dance by Josh Turner. May have heard a little intro in it in our last video. So I just chose like the book that I'm reading this month. <laughs> this is and it's Jody Pickley's of the Pact, and it is so good. It's so sad. Oh my goodness. Okay, so my favorite is Fifty Shades of Grey. Ow, ow, Rachi. E. James. Now this is not for all age groups. Let's put it that way. It is an erotic romance for mature it's audiences. So just kidding. It's not, but like it is. I'm not um, even allowed to read yeah. it. I'm 16. I'm not allowed to read it. Me and my so. mom and actually my brother have all read it, which is kind of awkward. <laughs> oh, that's weird. But, that's a really um, weird. okay, here's, here, I'm wanting to talk about this. Okay, go for it. So, I fir the first 150 pages I was reading it and I was like, this is disturbing. It, I was like, alright, you know what, I'm just going to keep reading because I have nothing else to read. So I kept reading it and then you just become so involved in the characters and then you get more into like their relationship and why it is they are the way they are and why they've chosen to do what they're doing and oh it's addicting to our favorite finito please please try some of them and do I, I hope that you love them as much well, as we do and once again we'll write down all the ones that we did in the down bar so then if you ever do a video leave it as a video response so we can watch it because we would love to know what your weird favorites are like I said, always looking for a book, so tell them what your favorites are. Woohoo! Um, so yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, and our next video is going to be our beauty favorites. Beauty favorites, always exciting. So be looking for that, and thank you so much for watching. Thanks, guys. Bye, guys! Do you look okay? I think that was everything good. Was everything jolly? Okay. All right. Hi everyone! Oh wait, I wasn't ready. I like the dark purple ones better, in case you didn't hear it the first time. I did hear you and just to ignore you. I think they're better. Because they have chocolate in them. <laughs> I mom's. made this one, you can look. Oh, mom. That little toe. Oh! oh that's awkward. Oh. It's got a little pockets and they're a little magnetic.